War Robots gets the seventh anniversary update! And it is huge. New map, Abyss. This is a very special map designed together with War Robots community. Abyss has lots of places for different playstyles. The main feature? These teleports. They allow even the slower robots to move quickly from one side of the map to another. Lots of possibilities in here. Anniversary event. War Robots turns 7 this month. Let's celebrate! For every year in the game you get 100 coins once the event starts. We have added guaranteed prizes to certain chests, introduced special editions of Scald, Scorcher and Incinerator, and lots of new items. Mm, where do we start? New robot, Orochi. One of the fastest robots in the game, Orochi is great for beacon control or quick sabotage behind the enemy lines. Wanna push your killer snake a step further? Consider the new module, Nitro Unit. It is designed for saboteur robots like Orochi, Loki or Phantom. It increases the movement speed up until you take a certain amount of damage. Legendary pilot, Ghost. Did you hear the rumors about the secret space tech unit named Ghost? Some say it is a real deal. Some believe it's just some robopilot superstition. I'm sure though that this new pilot can power up your Orochi's weapon. Let's keep going. New Titan, Sharanga. The new Titan is all about weapon power. Three alpha slots with a short damage boost make Sharanga an amazing sniper. If anyone dares to come close to you, you can face shift them or rather face exile them away to win some time and strike back. Titan weapon, Striker and Kray. Striker is an alpha energy weapon with 800 meter range. It is amazing against small crowds as it not only damages the target but also administers severe shock to one or two enemies close by. You really should have trained for this one. There is also a new beta arm, Kray. 500 meter energy auto cannon with added corrosion damage. A great pick against Titans, as Corrosion ignores their damage resistances. Drone Rework In this update, we have streamlined drones according to your feedback. Each drone is now a unique unit with its special ability and its own combination of sockets. All drones now have fewer microchip sockets. Now each chip matters more and building drones takes less resources. We removed energy capacity and battery chips and added a new type of chips. Shield chips activate Ensile, Aegis or Absorber in certain situations to help you survive. For each battery chip in your inventory, you will get a new Absorber and Aegis chip. Two for one, pretty good deal. For more info, read the article on our website. The link is in the description. And in the following update, we'll also introduce a way to make use of those chips that you don't need any longer. Stay tuned. Game Room Migration Finally, Game Room players can now move their profiles to any other PC platform. You will find the instructions in the game use or by the link in the description. Happy hunting, commanders! As always, press like if you like the update and stay here for more content if you wanna, we have plenty of it. Check the video on making of the Abyss map here. Here we have the Orochi overview and here is the video about Charanga here. In the pinned comment below, under this video, you'll find the details on the giveaway. Whew, I think we covered it all. But check the update notes just in case, the link is down below. Good luck and see you!